Welcome back to Mycology Exploration. In this video, I believe this is going to be part three of a three-part series on birdseed, wild birdseed, WBS. Showing you this final step before the pressure cooker, and you're going to want to pressure cook at 15 PSI for an hour and a half. So we pressure cook these jars in between uses and I'll be filling them to the 12 here with this clean bird seed. We did, we did the three hour soak, three rinses in between, and then we would be putting these modified lids on top after I fill them and then foil since they do have a modified lid. In the pressure cooker. So this is the final step just to show you what it looks like here. We just pour it out on this towel and then a paper, paper towel. However, you're going to pressure cook so all is well here. It looks really good and I really just wanted to show you what the bird seed looks like after a three hour soak with three rinses over the three hours. So you can see how clean and hydrated. It's hydrated. So we're gonna get it into the jars and then we're gonna pressure cook. And it's actually nighttime here. So we'll pressure cook for an hour and a half and then we'll let them cool overnight and then we are going to be putting both slurry and LC with a syringe right in here. And we'll be growing two different types of mushrooms. And again, with the modified lids, you'll need to use the foil on top. So this is the part three. And your bird seed should look like this, whether you do the three hour soak with three rinses or you do the two five minute boils. Either way, it works. It just depends on if you want to go fast or if you have some time. Choices. Life is full of choices. So many options. Much love. We'll see you in the next one.